Marcos uh, administration, Mrs. Uh, Marcos uh, had been interested in the uh, restoration of uh, Intramuros. Uh, she uh, uh, led the restoration of uh, some of the gates of uh, Intramuros. Mrs. Marcos got uh, the engineering divisions of uh, the different uh, services of the uh, military. And, uh, there were lots of objections. I called the attention of President Marcos. So he asked me to draft uh, uh, a charter for Intramuros, which is what I did, and that is the Intramuros Administration uh, Charter. satisfaction I had was uh, the presence of a good team uh, headed by uh, Mrs. Esperanza Gatmonton and uh, in the early days uh, also Felix uh, Imperial uh, because uh, basically the three of us uh, were the ones who set the initial uh, directions of uh, the Intramuros administration. important because it's part of our history, part of our heritage, one of the few physical evidences uh, remaining of uh, the uh, Spanish period of Philippine history. I think uh, the major development uh, since uh, that time uh, was the proliferation of informal settlers. And uh, it seems to me that uh, the uh, proper uh, and humanitarian relocation of those informal settlers is uh, critical to the uh, future progress of the countries. I'm uh, Jaime Laya. And uh, I think the, uh, the directions of uh, uh, the development of Intramuros are embodied in the administration uh, charter continue to be relevant. <laughs>